Mike, I know, uh, you know getting, getting started in training camp is a big deal. What's your feelings like uh, as you're you, you know, checking in for camp and getting ready to <clears throat> play for the Falcons? Um, it's, it's really exciting. Uh, like I said, like it's, it's really a dream to be home. So, I mean, I, I'm here early, so I, I think that speaks for it a lot. You know, been here since like eight, so I'm just ready to go. Uh, and um, you know, how, how what's your plan to eat to, to um, you know, get into camp? Do you ease into camp, jump into camp, or uh, how does that work? And what will that be like for for you and the and the Falcons? Uh. I expect to jump right in. Like I don't, I don't know how you can ease into it, but um, my expectations, my expectations is for it to be hard. A lot of people say, "Hey, Mike Davis, RB one." Uh, you know, Michael Turner came in after he was a reserve <laughs> and took it over. Uh, what are your hopes to take over as a RB one for the Atlanta Falcons? Um, I just want to come out and win, man. I ain't really too much press for. You know the stats or whatever that comes with it. Um, I'm just here to, you know, to try to make the team better, my teammates better, and I just want to win. That's all that matters. Does, it, does this does this look any different for you? Does this feel any different for you because it is home, because it is, you know, the team you grew up with? Yeah, it feels a lot different. Uh, that drive, oof, only you know, I don't have to really pack. That's all I have is my backpack. So, you know. Home is nothing but, you know, 50, you know, 30 to 50 minutes from here. So, yeah, it feels a lot different. Was that What was that drive like this morning for you? Were you like, nervous? Or were you just I was anxious like, this morning. I was just really ready to get here. Um, it's, it's really fun to be around your teammates, man. I miss being around my guys, you know, OTAs. You know, it meant a lot to be there with them and, and you know, to practice against them. So, honestly, I just can't wait to be out here, be in the locker room and joking with my guys. One uh, burden that comes with being a hometown guy is the uh, family ticket request. <laughs> they started stacking us yet? Uh, yeah, of course. Uh, the ticket thing has been already outrageous, <laughs> but um, uh, been in the league. Uh, it's going on year seven, so I know how to say no. Mike, what's the relationship been like with Matt so far? Uh, getting into his new role, and now he's been in it for a while. What's that relationship like between you guys? Uh, the relationship is, is really good between me and Matt. I mean, he's a veteran guy. He knows what to look for. Uh, really smart out there on the field. So anytime you have a smart quarterback like Matt, I mean, it's always a plus. You, you weren't really around much during the voluntary workouts. What, what, what were you doing? What were you doing to get ready for this? You said I wasn't here doing voluntary workouts? No, you weren't on the field. Oh, no, I was here. Uh, <laughs> but, I mean. Oh, yeah, I have a routine, but it's, you know, honestly, nothing really is. Whatever coach asks me to do, you know, I'm doing it. So I'm, I'm not a guy who has other stuff, has a way. I don't really have a way. You know, I've been grinding ever since, you know, since I got in the league. So I'm in that mode of whatever it takes. What have you heard so far about the um, commitment to the running game from Coach Smith and, and, and this coaching staff and, you know, where this, this team was last year in Russia? Um, I don't know where we were last year in rushing. Uh, honestly, I, don't, I mean, to be honest, I don't know where, you know, how the play calling is going to go. I don't know what players we're going to run. I might have an idea. I might not. I don't know what we have going on. You saw what he did in Tennessee. Of course. Time. I've seen everything he's done in Tennessee, but I, I don't know what's the game plan here. One more. What's the excitement about? Of course. I mean, I, I feel like every everybody always dream of, of playing at home. Uh, you know, growing up, like I said, I was a Falcon fan, so I, I've legit seen everybody. Algie Crumpler, Vic, I've, you know, I've seen everything growing up. So, of course, you know, the Falcons are my dream team, and to actually play for the Falcons is, is a dream come true.